Good afternoon, everybody. I hope everybody is having a great afternoon. My name is Christy and welcome to my channel. So today I have a Easter spring decor haul. Uh, I have quite a few stores we're gonna do the haul from. I have Walmart I wanna show you guys, just a couple of items from Target. I have Hobby Lobby. And then at the end, I have a few thrift pieces. I did go by the thrift store and pick up a few pieces there if you guys like that kind of uh, decor and thrifting. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and start. Let's get into the haul. All right, the first store I'm gonna do is gonna be Walmart. I picked up quite a few things from Walmart. The first one, I picked up a couple of planners. I picked up this gray planner. This, of course, is from Better Homes and Gardens, and it's got a gray, really nice texture. I picked this one up. It's a nice neutral color, and this was around $10. All right, for my next planner I picked up, it calls this a, a, white, a bubble white planner. I picked this one up as well. This was like $9.99. Uh, it's also Better Homes and Gardens. It's a really nice piece. I like a nice neutral color, and I'm looking forward to using this one as well. They have pretty reasonable prices on their planners. So the next thing I picked up, and I knew exactly where I was going to put this. I love the color on it. Is this bunny trail sign? This was only $4.98. It's a pretty good length. It also has a little bunny bunny tail right there, like a cotton tail. I thought that was a nice little touch. And I'm actually going to put that right here. Perfect. All right, next, let's get into a few bunny items that I got. The first one, this was $12.97. This was a really beautiful white bunny that they had. Again, neutral colors. You could use it with your pastels or neutrals, either one. This one was $12.97. It also lights up. So I don't know if you guys can see, probably in front of my shirt you can. Good. It lights up and it's really beautiful. So I picked this bunny up. And if you want this one, you might want to go. They were flying off the shelves. I'm sure it'll be pretty popular with that white because everybody loves a white bunny, right? The next item is this little candy dish. I know I've bought these before with Valentine's Day and the different holidays. I only saw it in white. They may come out with another color, but I only, only saw the white. This one was $3.98 for this little candy dish. And this normally goes really great on a tear tray. You could also put it in your bathroom, maybe bath salts, things like that. So you could fit some really small items in there. So I like picking these up on the different seasons. The next item was this beautiful gold bunny. I really, really like this bunny. They had two in this gold. The other bunny was laying down. So if you wanted the two, you could get both. I only got the upright one because I, I liked this style better. Uh, and this one was only $4.98. So again, real cheap decor, but it looks really good. Nice, elegant. I like the neutral gold. It's really nice. Uh, the next one, this was $5.98. This little wooden bunny. Again, really pretty, like a whitewashed kind of farmhouse style, actually. It was $5.98. It's on the little pedestal. And uh, it's not very large. It's probably about six inches tall, I'm just guessing. But again, a nice another, you could put it around your greenery, sticking up out of your greenery or in a basket. A lot of opportunities for this little piece, so I thought it was super cute. Another thing, I have many, many bins of Easter, so I'll be getting into them the next couple days, but I know I have eggs in there, so I didn't really buy a whole lot of eggs on this haul, but I did get these nice neutral colored eggs. I picked up two dark and then two light colored. They are speckled. These were only 54 cent and you can always take these, stick them down into a plant or greenery, you know, nice and for 54 cent. I mean, you could pick up a few of these and do, you know, mailbox piece. I mean, any kind of decorative piece you could do that with. All right, I think that's pretty much my Walmart items. Uh, the next two items, they're not really springtime, but I always love kitchen pieces from Target. 
Uh, I picked up the two pieces, um, hearth and hand pieces. I just got the nice wooden measuring spoons. These were $9.99, I believe. Yeah, $9.99. I really like the wooden handles. I like a vintage farmhouse style and uh, neutral colors, so these work out really well. I love her pieces. Just, just. And then I also got, these are out of the box, but they're really huge. I didn't know that this, this measuring cup was, but I mean, this is actually, um, a two cup piece why it's so big and these were $16.99 but again the wooden handle really nice I really like that and it's two cups so it's really I love those pieces from the hearth and hand all right the next thing we're gonna um, get into is the Hobby Lobby I got a lot of neutral things I did get a lot of spring colors from Hobby Lobby as well and some florals so the first piece we're gonna go over is this beautiful basket that I got from Hobby Lobby. It was $29.99, which is a little pricey, but it's 40% off. So it was a really nice piece. You can, you know, hang it, use it as decor, put some flowers coming out of it. It's a really nice, beautiful piece. It has a nice square, square bottom. Planner I bought on clearance. Has a nice inside sits up by itself so it's a really really beautiful basket and i think it was a good price for 40 percent off and then also i got this little clearance planner that was what was hiding inside of it this was on sale for $2.99 and again a really nice beautiful it's kind of a cream um with brown specks in it piece where you could put just a little greenery enough for small spaces and for $2.99 i mean can't beat that the next thing I got was this little chocolate bunny. I, I do not have a chocolate bunny in my decor, which I couldn't believe, but I, I don't. And this one was uh, $5.99 and it was also 40% off. It doesn't have any pastel colors. It's just a solid chocolate, which I'm okay with. If I wanna add any colors, I'll put some jelly beans or I'll put you know, some speckled small eggs. I have those in a basket and call it a day, but I really wanted a chocolate bunny. And this one was perfect and again 40 percent off so it was really cheap i also got these two little white bunnies these are excellent for tear trays small bathroom shelves things like that they were 4.49 a piece and they were 40 percent off because their easter stuff is on sale i thought they were really really cute and then this one it's like a different Really cute. And again, I love the white. They have a little slight pink tint to them in their ear. Just enough color. Stays really neutral, really pretty. So those were a great buy. So I got those. And then next, this was in their Easter section, of course. I got the He Is Risen. It's a wood sign. And uh, this was $9.99, but it was 40% off as well. It's with their Easter decor. And uh, I really like this piece because that's why we celebrate the season, right? So it has the crown of thorns there and it's just a really pretty wood. And I really, I really thought it was a good deal at 40% off for this piece. You can hang it in the middle of a greenery wreath. You could put it off to itself. You could stick it down in something and let just the same. I mean, it's got a lot of possibilities. So I really like this piece. Another thing I picked up was this, and I thought I was going to have to go to a thrift store to get this because I haven't really seen any, and but I really haven't been looking lately for them, is this pegboard for like hanging your pocketbooks and I mean, gardening tools and um, sun hats and things like that. I do love the color of this wood. It's really, really pretty, and it's really, really, really nice. Uh, this piece was $25.99 and it was part of their wall decor, so it was 40% off as well. So, I mean, that's that's an excellent deal. Um, and it's got a lot of pegs on it. I really think that's going to work out really nice on the wall. And now I'm going to get into my florals. Okay, next, you guys, we're going to get into the spring florals that I bought. I bought quite a few florals. I actually love how they're packing them in this paper now and 
I used to, they shove them down in the big bag and I would lose some of my stems and they would break off. So I'm really liking the way they're doing that now. It's the first time my store's done it that way, but I really like that. The first floral, I only bought one of these because I needed one. I bought these several months ago and they didn't have the light color. So I went back and got one. This one was $12.99 and 40% off. Really pretty. And I needed one more light one. They have a darker color and I kind of mix those together. All right, the next set that I got, I only got all these florals were 40% off at Hobby Lobby. I like to wait for the week they put everything on sale because you can get some really good uh, florals at a good price. All right, the next ones are these beautiful white. They look like paper. I don't, don't quote me on that, but they look kind of like paper whites. I don't know if that's what you call them, but the greenery, the leaves are really pretty, beautiful. I absolutely love these. I only got two of them because I feel like that's enough for these two, but I think they're gonna work out really nice. These were only $7.99 a piece and they were 40% off. So that's a really good deal. Another thing, when you go to Hobby Lobby, and I forget this a lot of the times because I go in and I might get all excited over the florals and I forget to look. And some of you may already know this, but when you go to Hobby Lobby, um, and look at their prices, you may have these two stems and this one is $9.99 and this one is $7.99. And what happens is they're cheaper and then when they get another truckload of stuff, they increase their prices. So if you dig through, make sure, cause I've got up to the counter for these and one was one price and one was another. And of course you want the two cheapest ones, obviously. But I forget to do that. So you guys keep that in mind. And that's on most items in Hobby Lobby, especially in their floral section. So. Always look because you will find mismatched prices and you could get the cheapest price. All right, so these were $7.99. All right, so the next ones were these beautiful baby's breath in this it's like a cream khaki color. I got three of these. That's another thing they grab on each other like crazy too. Actually, I only got two of these. Yeah, I got two of these because I got two of these and two white. So there is like a sand color, really, really pretty. And these were only $5.99, 40% off, and you can mix these with your Easter. And I really, really love that color. Uh, so I got two of those. And then I also, because I do like white florals in the spring, especially if I mix doing pastel colors or white bunnies and, and true greenery. So I like the white, this is the true white. And again, these were $5.99, 40% off. So I got two of those. For the next ones, I bought these, which I think is a beautiful stem. They're kind of droopy and they, they're white, but they have a lot of the light green in them. Super, super pretty. Let me see if I can get close up. You know, you could drape these out of like that basket that I have and let them just hang out there and with a sun hat, all that looked really, really pretty. I don't know what you call these, but they are really, really beautiful. And these were $9.99, 40% off, and I got two of these. And then I also, I have something similar to this in like a fall style, but I looked and they're different. I got these just like brown stems. Did I get just two of these? They were $9.99. And I'm gonna try to get them really close. Or they're just a brown, beautiful green leaves. You can put them in a tall vase and just let them you can mix them with just about anything because they're so neutral, but just as the wood, so you can get the wood texture. And then they were a really good price, about six bucks a piece. So, and they're really, really long. So I like using those and you could use them in a vase and a white vase just by themselves. If you get three or four, that would be nice and full. You don't have to mix it with anything. You know, something really simple. If you're a simplistic decorator, then absolutely that would be great. You can use them for, through the full spring. The next I got these poppies. I got several different colors and these are so hard to find, but I actually really had a lucky day with the florals. I kept getting compliments in my buggy on the way. Everybody was loving the colors. So 
but these are the neutral poppies. You can tell I love this color just by my haul, but these are really, really pretty, they're beautiful. These, I think they had last year. I could not get my hands hold of them. These were $6.99, 40% off. And then I got three of that color. I got two of the darker color. This is like a more, you can see the color on that. These were $6.99, same price. So I got two of these. And these would look really good. I'm looking at some, um, moss that kind of just drapes out of the pot on Amazon. I think I'm going to order me some of it. And this was about the same texture. So I think that this will look really good mixed with them in a planner. So I got two of the dark color. And then I only got one of the whites. And this white looked really darker than the normal. It looked almost like a cream white, but I think it's really beautiful. I only got one. I wanted more, but I'm going to Got this one for now and I'll have to go back for some more because I really love the white. But that was all we had. These last two is probably my favorite stem of what I've got. This one also was the most expensive. These were $16.99 a piece. And um, I figured just by the colors and the design of the flower, I mean, this just screams spring. So these are probably really popular as well. I actually got the last, only got two because there was two which I think that'll be plenty for what I'm gonna do with them. But, so if you really like the stem, try to get to Hobby Lobby really quick. It was 40% off of $16.99, but it was probably the priciest stem I bought. So it's really, really beautiful. There was actually a lady in the store looking for these and she saw them in my buggy. These were the last two, so. Yeah, so try to run out and grab these and these will go off these springs, beautiful color. I also got one more set, and these are actually not from Hobby Lobby, but it's the only thing that I've purchased so far this year from Michaels as far as their stems because I, I got so lucky at Hobby Lobby. I didn't feel like I need to purchase more at Michaels, but I did get these for a little color, and these are pink. They are called Cotton Candy, right? They're regular price. Look how big. I mean, I mean, look at that. Look at that bloom, and I'm a little old person, but I'm just saying. Really full, plump bloom. It's beautiful. I love the color of the leaves. These are regularly $9.99 at Michael's, but they were running a buy two, get three, or buy three, get two. I can't remember, but I got five of them for like really, really cheap, and you build rewards there, so I had some rewards. I think I paid six bucks for all these, but, but look how beautiful. And you can put these with your pastel eggs or your white bunnies or, you know, all of that. So really, really good deal, really good find. And they also have this color in white, which is a beautiful white. So if you're more neutral and you don't want to go with any pastel or the pink, you can always go with white. So I'm going to go get you some of those. <clears throat> I really, really like those. All right, all I have left uh, for this particular video is my thrift items. I do have one thing I picked up from Ross. Again, one item. I'm not sure. Ross usually, I do go to Ross, but this time only since I have so much in my bins that, and we're living in our guest home right now. I'm not decorating a full, I mean, it's a pretty nice guest home. It's 900 square feet. And so I have plenty of decor to decorate, but I do like to pick up new items. This piece was from Ross. It was $14.99, and this is a beautiful bunny planner. I mean, I just love, look at the bunny. It's just beautiful. And for $14.99 inside, I don't know if I'm going to, I haven't decided yet if I'm going to use this piece inside or outside, because you could really use it out on our patio here, or, um, I could use it in here in front of the mirror with some greenery and some, I mean, I mean, the opportunities are endless, but so I'm really excited about this piece. They had another one that was just like a big plump like one bunny that you could put planters in the top and he was really, he was $20, I think, but I liked this one a little bit better. Kind of like the bunnies who are working together and I love the color of it. So that was the only item I picked up from Ross so far. All right, got some thrift items that I'm going to run by. A lot of people I know love to thrift. Some don't. It's fine. I like to go thrifting here lately because I'm getting older and I love to go through and see the different finds that I can see and some of the things I see that my mother used to have and some pieces that I remember being in my grandmother's home and 
when you're decorating with your own style and things and you know you see things that remind you of your childhood I just I love going through thrift stores so it's kind of a thing for me lately so I picked up some thrift items that I want to go over the first thing was these two goblets they're like a ribbed let's see like a ribbed clear glass they also had these in blue I don't do a whole lot of blue because I just don't have a lot of blue decor pieces. I think blue is beautiful and I know it's kind of in right now. I think it looks absolutely beautiful. I just don't have a lot of blue pieces that it would go with like china and stuff like that. These were only a dollar a piece so I thought that was a really good, good steal. So I got those and only got two. I also picked up this little piece, this little, I don't know if you want to call it like candy dish or really, really pretty. It's like crystal. Uh, this was only a dollar. You know, and you could put jelly beans or, you know, on your table by your coffee bar. You could put some Splenda or just whatever it is, whatever you want to, just to add a nice elegant touch to your decor. Because I do a lot of woods, a lot of basket textures, things like that, but this is really an elegant look and I kind of want to add a little bit more of that this year. I also found this piece. I've never seen it. I don't know what it is. This basket, but my mother-in-law actually I was with her and she said I've got one of those at home and sure enough she did. This is like a nice beautiful glass bowl and it has look how pretty it's looped in these beautiful I mean it's just absolutely gorgeous. It's got like I want to say yeah it's got like a fruit pattern to it and then this neutral colored handle it's absolutely beautiful if you guys know that there's a specific use for this or you know what have any ideas of what I could do with it I mean I can put greenery in it or I can use it in my kitchen either one but it's absolutely beautiful let me know if you guys have seen one of these before and any great ideas you might have because that's a new item to me all right the next one I found were these wooden shoe stretchers i haven't seen these in years i love to decorate with old items like this when i'm going for more of a like a vintage cottage type theme very you know lacy neutral kind of thing but i haven't seen these in years and it is a right and a left <laughs> i didn't think to look at that before i bought them but they were only four dollars and I know these are hard to find. You can find them on eBay and stuff, but I, I really just wanted to find them for a good price and I just found these, so I thought these would be really nice. So I bought those. I also find, I'm kind of random with my utensils, but I do like unique ones. I bought this wooden fork. I think it was a quarter to go in my crock with my wooden spoons and taste air spoons and stuff. And I also got this nutcracker with the wooden handles which goes excellent, matches the measuring cups and the spoons I just bought. So it's really nice. These were a quarter. You can't beat that. And then I also picked up uh, a couple of books I got. They had this really beautiful white Bible. I don't think it's truly, truly that old. It's actually an international children's Bible because it has you know it's got some age on it it's really really pretty i do not have a white bible and it tells in the front how to, to bring children to jesus and to describe it in that way and i think that's just a, a really really nice piece and the thrift store that i went to actually has a whole shelf of bibles and they don't charge people for the bibles which i found is really really nice too so i got this i also found for 50 cents the book the christmas blessing hardback this is the sequel to the christmas shoes if you guys are familiar with those books so for 50 cent i went ahead and picked that up i also picked up um this hearth and hearth and hand rug this was at one of the goodwills i went to and it's pretty good size some of you might recognize this one but yeah so it's hearth and hand I don't know what year this rug was. That's never been used. It's brand new. It's gray and white with the stripes. And it was only $3. So I definitely picked this up because I'm always looking for a nice, really, really beautiful neutral rug. And I like the texture of it. There's one more thing that I picked up. I think was this sun hat they had, let me get that closer, 
they had this beautiful sun hat. I'm always looking. It was brand new. At the time, it had the tags on it. This is a Sonoma brand. And I don't know if y'all are familiar with Sonoma, but Sonoma, I buy a good bit at Kohl's. It's a really good brand. This hat still had the tags, but I've been wearing it outside in the afternoons when we go out to the Adirondack Terrace because the sun's been out. But it was brand new for $3, so try to keep an eye on items like this. I found it with the pocketbooks in the pocketbook section. So it was it's really, really nice. I like the color, the nice brown. I thought that was a really good deal. And then I also found this, it's like, call it a, a crossbody kind of, like a wallet on a string. It says Michael Kors. Now, I have Michael Kors pocketbooks and things like that, but I've never really bought one of their wallet on strings. I don't know, for all I know, it could be a knockoff, but it's never been used. It doesn't really matter to me. It was $3.75 because they considered it a wallet inside. It's, no, I mean, it's just brand new. Love it. And it does have a little minor ding on it right there in the leather, but I'm good with it. I can patch that up somehow, I'm sure. And uh, like I said, when you're shopping, especially when you're carrying a lot of florals, crossbody in the store, you're good to go. So for $3.75, I picked that up and I love the color because you could use this with just about anything. One more item I forgot I picked up was this shawl. It's just like this woven shawl. Does it have? It was only $2. It was really, really pretty. I like the color, very neutral. So I'm really excited about this. Um, and for $2, I think that was a really good deal. All right, everybody, that's it for the haul that I have from those stores. I do have another haul coming soon. I've done some home goods shopping and Marshalls, TJ Maxx, and a little bit of Dollar Tree. So I have that haul that I'll be posting in the future, but I figured this was enough for this one and a lot of the things were similar. So that's all I've got for you today. If you enjoyed this video, give me a like and put a comment down below of anything you wanna see or any places from hauls or any decor ideas you may have. I'm excited to hear all of them. If you like videos like this, please subscribe to my channel as I'm new and growing and I would really appreciate it. All of you have an excellent day and stay blessed and I'll see you on the next one.